Meet record, you must feel happy about that. Yeah, I'm really excited about that part of it. Um, just, I've been trying to get a new, or I've been trying to become the best in the state for a while. Now, and like, I've been close a couple of times, but it just hasn't quite gone for me yet. So, I'm just hoping to get that extra little, those couple of inches that I need to just. How much are your coach was talking about the change? Was this the first time you used the pole going for the... Yeah, that was the or that's actually the second time I got onto that pole. But that was the first time I actually got into the pit. Every other time I'd just been going straight up and down like I did on my first two attempts. So, yeah. What are you shooting for for this year? Is there a certain height you'd like to... Yeah, my, uh, my coach, his junior year of high school, he cleared 16.5. And my goal is pretty much just to beat that. Because every other year he was ahead of me so far. <laughs> when did you set the state best? It was like 16, what are you, 16.5? Oh, 16, me? Yeah. Oh, no, I set 16.1, putting me number one junior and third in the state overall. And that was at Arcadia. Okay. Yeah. So you feel like you're in pretty good form right now going into the home stretch of the season? Yeah, I, I feel great right now. I just, yeah, I mean, I feel good. Hey, hey congratulations. Good job. Thank you. Lewis and Newsom, Lewis and Newsom here coming through. Lewis beginning to pull. Here we go. Eight five, varsity boys, hundred, Camacho and Davis. How quickly here goes Camacho. See the, the Flip Bridge girl coming coming on the left with the right. I didn't see her, but I, I didn't hear her either. It was kind of a surprise, but I don't think I could have done anything else. So. How do you feel about your time? Um, it wasn't my best, but I'm pretty tired and sore, so I'm proud with what I could give. Great day out here, though, for track meter. Yeah, it's nice. It's better than the rain we've been having the past few weeks, but it's pretty hot. Hey, well, congratulations. Thank man. you. Shinless Oak Park in six. He's Susan Round. Excuse me, that is Roy Gonzalez from St. Timothy. Right to the front here as it gets down the back stretch, right in the tangent. So the 400. Um, well, that was my actually my first open 400 this year. Really? Um, I've been doing 4 by 4s and the mile and the 800, and then now I'm switching to a 4 8 combo, and that was my lifetime PR by um, just about eight tenths of a second. So. Oh, so you're pretty happy. Oh uh, yeah, really happy. Um, now, what happened in the 800? I mean, you've had a really good time this year, state one among the state best. Yeah. Um, that's still. Pretty happy with my time. It was like a 156 or something. Um, I could definitely feel that 400 had a toll on me, um, but I felt I, that I uh, finished really strong. And once I drop that 400 by CIF, I'll be able to drop about five seconds off that time. Are you planning to double on the 400 800s? No, I'm going to drop the 400. I'm just doing the 4 8 to uh, train so that it's that much easier when I. Don't have to do the floor right before. When that guy went ahead of you in the 800s, like about the back stretch, did you um, feel like I uh, still got enough in the tank to catch him? Yeah, I thought, I don't know, I was just going to let him pull me through and then uh, I finished really strong, but so did he. He had a lot left too. And I had a really good finish, but couldn't quite get him. What are your plans for the county meet next week? Um, I'm going to do the same thing a 4 8 combo. Um, we're on spring break, so 
a lot of our team yeah, outrank, so I won't be doing the 4x4 four four and that, just the 4 and the 8. Okay. Um, try to double, but that'll be, it'll be a lot like this week. There'll be really good competition in both races. All right, well, good. Thank you very much.